Hi, uh, in this question it is given that two solutions of milk and water are uh, mixed in the ratio 2 is to 3 and the resultant solution that means the weighted average was given which is equal to 40 percent milk solution and we have to find the concentration of the first solution given that the concentration of the second solution is 60 percent. So it is given that the concentration of the second solution was given right. So let us write the concentration of the second solution as 60 percent then the concentration of the first solution is x and the resultant solution was given so which is equal to 40 percent. So for simplification purposes just keep these percentage signs aside. Uh, now let us apply this allegation rule. So if you apply this allegation rule 60 minus 40 will give you 20, 40 minus x. So you can write as it is 40 minus x here. Now the ratio between these two will give you in what ratio these two solutions are mixed. So that means uh, 20 by 40 minus x will give you in what ratio these two are mixed. But in the question it is given that these two are mixed in the ratio 2 is to 3 right. So you can simply make uh, equate this uh, ratio to 2 is to 3. Then you can simply cross multiply them. So 60 3 into 20 60 80 minus 2x. Therefore uh, send this 2x to this side. So 2x equal to 20 therefore x equal to 10. So this is the required answer. And you can also solve this question by using weighted average formula also that is also possible. So do not think that this question can only be solved by using allegation rule. So the weighted average formula will tell us that uh, when there are two mixers with uh, x and y concentrations and we are mixing them in the ratio m and n then the final average will be given by a correct. So here it is given that the resultant solution is 40. And uh, the first quantity m we need to find out. No, no, no. The m was already given. So m is equal to 2, right? The first quantity we have taken as 2. And the concentration we need to find out, right? So which is equal to x. And 3 into uh, 60, the concentration of the second solution, divided by uh, 2 plus 3. So here m, m and n will become 2 and 3 respectively. Now you can simply cross multiply. So 5 into 40 will give you 200 which is equal to 2x plus 180 and 180 comes to this side which will become 20. So 20 equal to 2x that means x equal to 10. So here x is equal to 10 that means the concentration of the first solution is equal to 10 percent. 